honestly such a privilege to be in top two, especially because it's series 10 of Australia's Next Top Model. This is what I've been dreaming of. I feel like I'm on the brink of making top model history. 10 years of Australia's Next Top Model. Oh, That's a super bloody model in the making. She's great. Have delivered the most extraordinary success stories. This picture says to me, move over, Moss. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Alice. Amanda, I thought was one of the real models. Yeah, I thought she was good. I am very confidently say Montana Golf internationally tomorrow. This year, the talent has been greater than ever before. There it is. Look at you. But so have the challenges. Beautiful, beautiful. Week after week. Look up there. I don't want to be embarrassed. I have to stand out. Shoot after shoot. I don't think about the call. We need to get you to hospital. The girls battle. I'm going to bring it. I'm ready. I'm here to chill it. I need the whole car in her wasting time. To survive elimination. I'm so sorry. The last score. That means you've been eliminated. Now. since the very beginning and I think I can say with complete authority that Elena and Sabine are the two strongest contestants that we've ever had. I look at that and I can see that in French Elle. The face is so beautiful. So amazing. Look at your body. That's your shot, sweetheart. That's your shot. And the best part is that they're both so different. I've always wanted to be a model. It's always been a dream, like something that I could never do. Elena is a 16-year-old schoolgirl. I love school. My favourite subject is probably maths because both of my parents are maths teachers. Beautiful. But she has a sophistication and an elegance which is far beyond her years. That's amazing. She looks like someone who's been modelling for a while. She was the front runner from the very beginning. Wow. So it's a 10. So it's a 10. 10. Yeah, you're one to watch, honey. <laughs> but when people expect you to be number one all the time, that's a lot of pressure. Elena's killing it in the competition. You set the bench very high <laughs> for everybody. Oh. She gets an amazing photo every week. It might be someone else's turn. Amazing. I wonder the girls are not rip her hair out. <laughs> I can see why. I just feel like everyone hates me. <laughs> Elena is definitely here to win. But the question is now, can she beat Sabine? Modeling is my dream. It is what I want to do. And I need to show that I'm confident. I can do this. I would describe Sabine as an accidental model. You know, she came from Byron. She's like that cool hippie chick. I'm a shy, quiet girl, and I just believe in more alternative ways of life. I think everybody underestimated Sabine in the beginning. It's not the most flattering position. Sabine, I think it's pretty. I think it can do better. I just would have loved to have seen a bit more movement. But since then, she's scored more tens than any other girl. It's a ten for me. A ten. I've waited my whole life for this picture. Great, great, great. That's cool. Great, Sabine. Yeah, amazing. Work. You're showing us young, fresh, effortless, natural. Sabine's proven that she has what it takes to win, but there can only be one.
Elena Sabine. In just a few short days, one of you will be named Australia's next top model. Oh. <laughs> it's amazing. It's so crazy. You both survived each week by producing stunning shots. The only thing standing in the way of you and taking this competition out is one last photo shoot. Oh. Today, you'll be shooting an eight-page editorial for leading fashion magazine, Elle Australia. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's a proper modelling job. That's what we have to do, and I just can't believe that we get to do that. You both have to nail multiple looks in just one day. There'll be one hero shot selected for each of you, and that will be the one that Megan, Alex, and I will judge you on. Whoever gets the highest score for this final photo will be crowned Australia's next top model. I worked so hard and I just want to kill this shoot. Sabine is an incredible model. I really just want to show you that I can be just as editorial. I know I can do it. Elena has been one of the favourites from the start, but... I feel like I'm peaking just at the right time, so hopefully I can keep that momentum and take the title of being Australia's next top model. Congratulations! Congratulations! How are you? Well done. Well done. Hi, Chucky Chucky. Hi. Hi. So yeah. it's, it's so amazing to finally be here with you guys doing this. So today's super exciting, your last photo shoot. Yeah. So it's an eight-page editorial for Elle magazine. It's pretty sick. Elle magazine is huge. Imagine opening it in your face being there. <laughs> guys, so Justine Cullen is here, the editor-in-chief of Elle Australia, and George Anthony as well, who's shooting you guys. I mean, you have the most perfect team to make the shoot incredible. So make us proud. Yes. I know you Make will. Make yourself yeah. as well. Yeah. yeah. Girls, your brief day is modern princess. <laughs> wow. You guys need to make sure it looks cool, natural and modern. I think my look is quite edgy, so this brief today really suits me. Remember, the slate's being wiped clean, yeah. so none of your past problems will matter. It's all about what you do today, okay? So you really have to make it shine and make it work. Don't get rattled. It's really just yeah. about being yourself and showing Australia what you've made of. Yeah. Yeah. I'm really nervous about the brief. It's not girly. It's about being a really cool, tough girl, and that is really hard to do, so I'm really worried. There's so much pressure today. We're shooting for Elle magazine, so both Elena and I have to really step up our game. Instinctively, we would cast Sabine because her look is so magic. You probably wouldn't put a girl as classically, commercially pretty as Elena in clothes like that. You need the contrast. So it's going to be how she responds to that brief. That's the mark of a great fashion model. Hey, guys. This is Sabine. This is Justine and George. Hello. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to see you. <laughs> I think the thing with this shoot is that they're quite sexy clothes, but with Elle, it's a tough sexy. So, you, mm. you know, you have to have a real womanly strength about it. Yeah. It's not an easy task. No, no. <laughs> and then you need to bring that for eight pages. Yeah. So, yeah. Good luck. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and you'll be great. Thank you. There's a lot of pressure to perform well today. It really can decide if you become Australia's next up model or not. And I'm so determined to do this. I really want it. Literally, every shot something slightly different. Tuck into your shoulder with the chin, yet. And great. Now just relax it and eyes straight for me. Great. Yeah, beautiful there. Great there, great. Cool. You're always worried when you need to get eight pages and you're using a model who's never shot eight pages before because it is a big ask. Oh, it's really beautiful. They're great. The board is great. They're hold up. I think they're being so beautiful, but she's doing a really great job. Yep. That's it. Right there. This is beautiful. Chin up a little. 
to be relaxed into it really quickly. Right, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. She's really, really on the ball, really moving fluently. I really like that. That's top model material. Beautiful, great, they're great. Right there. It's beautiful. Chin up a little. Right, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Yeah, she looks amazing. Beautiful, they're great. That's gorgeous. Great there. Hold that. Watching Sabine shoot, she honestly just looks like she's been doing it for years. Oh, I love that how you just relax down into that. It's great. She is just so fluent and just giving so many different options for shots. She looks like a model. She looks so beautiful. Skin looks incredible. There was a lot of pressure with Elena watching on, but I felt like I really needed to show her that I was a big competition. That looks amazing. It motivated me to do even better. Great. Cool, 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 cool. I think we got that. Good job. Well done. Thank you. Good job. Thank you. Watching Sabine shoot, I'm just shaken up by it. She absolutely just killed it. How on earth am I going to be able to do better than that? Going into the photo shoot, I'm so nervous. Watching Sabine shoot, I'm still just shaken up by it. She absolutely just killed it. How on earth am I going to be able to do better than that? You know what's happening a little bit? You're hitting the click and you're going bang, 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 bang. And you're moving with each spot, with each shot. Don't. Okay. Just fluidly go through the movement. Yeah, I'm starting to psych myself out and really overthink it. Eyes for me. If the shoulders are just break it out, 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 and pulling through the chest. Yep. Facial expressions there. Keep that intense. <laughs> they were really looking for the moments in between the moments. It's not about posing and taking the picture. It's never been so important to get every single element of the shot right, and I'm just struggling so much. It's a bit posy down there, just keep all that coolness that you were doing before. Just keep, stay relaxed, just keep relaxed. Don't forget the face now. Come back to me with the face, yeah. yeah. Alright, I'm gonna have a quick look at that. I'm so nervous because this shoot decides who wins. Her natural tendency, I think, is to be, is to pose. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. But I think trying to drive the character through with her might be her challenge, you know, that variation and the variety that we need to make her an L girl. Yeah, it's absolutely a big challenge. When she's shooting real stories for real clients, you know, something like this where she needs to tell a story over eight different shots, you know, you can't spend all day trying to make somebody kind of get in the moment. Let's get ready for the next one. Yeah. Okay, we're going to shoot the next Maybe lean in onto it. Yep, great there, great there, great. Great there, great. I remember when Sabine first came onto the set in episode one, I could tell she was really quite nervous, but from what I've seen today, she takes direction very well, and she's really, I think, matured as a model, which has been great to see. Beautiful there, great there, cool. Great, is a gorgeous, great, love that, that's cool, cool there, that's really cool. I think Sabine's doing a great job. Oh, that looks amazing. Every shot, she's really just getting stronger and stronger, she's really coming into what we thought she could be, which is a great model. I don't know what's going on in your head, you're doing some good acting. Very good. Great right, action. This is my dream job, really. Great, beautiful there. I've tried so hard to do my absolute best, and I feel like I'm nailing it. Got it. Yeah, we got it. Good job. We got that. Good. Well done. Perfect. Perfect. So good. Well done. That's really special. The first shoot was really hard. I didn't walk off the set feeling like I got an amazing shot. I'm so disappointed in myself because I wanted to impress the, the client, and I didn't. 
I need to work my absolute best. The pressure is on and I just want to nail it. Give me all you are getting to keep anything you want to do, okay? What I want is a little bit less angry, but still strong. Just make sure there's an intensity there to have the, that strength coming through. Ever since I was a little girl, I've always wanted to be a model. This shoot is my last chance to show to everyone that I do have what it takes to be Australia's next top model. That's it, now keep going there, yep, right. It looks so beautiful. Right, this is good, this is good here. This is good. Beautiful, right there. And just like, yes, 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 and it's such a great feeling. I honestly, I'm so happy. This is quite beautiful, look at it. It's beautiful, it's just red. The texture's in it. Yeah. Based on my experience with Elena on the first episode, she's quite a posy girl. Doing all that stuff you're trying is great, but that doesn't make a good picture at all. And I felt like that was a bit of Elena at the beginning. I felt like she broke that mould and let go. Oh, yeah, you're feeling it now. It's great. This is good. This is the kind of stuff. Cool. Right. Well done. Gordon, yeah. You really want to win so you can see this one in print. Elena definitely has what it takes to be a top model. It's great there. She worked really well with George, and she understood how to work with the clothes. Beautiful. Right there. Yeah. That's it. Now, keep going there. Yep. Beautiful. Watching Elena do her shoot, it kind of, like, slaps you back into reality and be like, oh, this is a competition. Right. Beautiful there. Let one of the knees fall. That's it. That's it. Right. She's a natural. She seems to have gone from a 16-year-old girl to an international model. Right there. She can beat me, and that just drives me even more. Beautiful there. Cool. Got that well done. That's great. Good job. Beautiful. Amazing. Beautiful. I switched all day between who was my favourite and who was more of an L girl than the other. They really took on board every single piece of advice. So they were working with the clothes in such different ways, but they both personify the brand, I think. Amazing. She really worked hard for it. Today was such a long day. It was so hard at the start, but this is the real deal. This is what it's going to be like. This is an editorial spread. I've done absolutely everything that I could have done, and I'm so proud of myself. I actually felt like a model. I felt like I was modeling for Elle. Keep it really cool. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful there, beautiful, ice in the flight, what do you think? Mm. Do you think we got it? Yeah, it's amazing. Cool, well done. 
Good job. Got it. Well done. That's it. Shots and you know I can win. Today was just absolutely amazing. I loved every single minute of it. Bring on the finale. I mean, and you know what? It's so you can't split the girls. It's I can't so beat it. They're so different. Yeah. But just I love them both. Yeah, I agree. It's going to be a very tight race, I think. Coming up tonight is going to be the biggest finale show we have ever put on. To a surprise by old friends and an army of special guests. Oh my god, Kathy! Oh my god! Hopefully tonight's going to be absolutely amazing. Whatever the result. Yeah, whatever, whatever the results, I think we've both just done so well and should be so proud of ourselves. High five. <laughs> oh, that was crap. I definitely feel like I've grown into a model. Thinking about my future now, it revolves around modelling. This is my dream job. It's just in arm's reach. It's been the longest journey ever. I've worked so hard to be here and I'm so proud of myself for how far I've come. I really think I can win this. I think I can be Australia's next top model. nine years we've launched the careers of many young models just like you transforming them into world-class professionals tonight one of you will join our hall of fame as our 10th winner of australia's next top model that is massive tonight is going to be the biggest finale show we have ever put on and you two are the main event After the show tonight, your L Australia Hero shot will be revealed. <laughs> and then Megan, Alex and I will score your photo and announce the winner. <laughs> so That's just, oh. I can't believe standing at the finale that I can take the title of being Australia's next top model. It still feels so surreal and like nothing I've ever experienced before. There's no way we could put on the biggest show in history without giving him a little support. I uh, hope you don't mind. But I've organised a few familiar faces to join you on the runway. Oh my god. And here they come now. I can see. Yeah. <laughs> the reunion. <laughs> Summer, what do you think of our top two? It's amazing. They both look so gorgeous. I just feel like it's nice when people who are going to win are nice. And they're both so lovely. So it's like it makes my heart really happy that it's like Shelly's next up model is one of these two. Jordan, what do you think about this whole situation? I'm so proud of the both of them because, you know, they've both got such strong, unique looks. And I think they've both got you know, an equal chance of winning this. Now, all 13 of you will be taking part in tonight's finale show. 
will be dressed in ultra-modern, futuristic styling. Now there's just one more historic part of the show that I need to tell you about, because I love surprises, I to tell you. To celebrate the show's success over the past 10 years, tonight you'll be joined on the runway by 40 models who have walked in your shoes and who are forever a part of top model history. from every single season of Australia's Next Top Model. So that's an amazing feat. And can I say you girls are gorgeous? <laughs> Sabine and Elena, what do you think of this? I'm quite speechless. Yeah. You guys are all so beautiful yeah. and there's just so many of them. I can recognise so many faces and to know that I'm a part of like this legacy yeah. of strong women. Yeah. winner of Australia's Next Top Model. So 10 years on, career is still thriving. What can the girls expect? It's a lot of fun. It is, it is hard work to kind of keep going and stuff. And I know a lot of girls kind of get worried that, oh, I'm, I might work for like two or three years, but obviously I'm a testament to the fact that you can work for more than a decade. So, <laughs> so any advice for the girls tonight? Um, no, just try and relax and enjoy it. Like, it'll go by so quickly. You just want to really take the moment in. The night is going to be massive, so I think it's time for you girls to go off, get ready, good luck. Really? 
important quality. If I had to pick someone to win, I thought I don't know. I think it's too close to call. runway ever seen in top model history and then Elena and Sabine you beat thousands of hopefuls to be here but tonight there can only be one winner who will be Australia's next top model
Gemma and Cassie and Amanda and Simone who have gone on to have like, you know, incredible international careers. The girls from the first nine seasons are phenomenal, but our top 13, you like? Obviously, two girls that stole the show tonight. Please make them welcome, Sabine and Elena. <laughs> Congratulations, you are our top two. Elena, what was it like walking in a show like that? High fashion, fast pace. It was amazing. It honestly, it just, from the first show we did with Alex Perry to this, just the transformation of everyone is just absolutely amazing and having all the girls from past series is just so incredible yeah. and there was so much adrenaline and yeah. just, it was great. It was really amazing. Louisa, what did you think of the <laughs> show, seeing your baby up there? <laughs> I can't believe the transformation either. I was not prepared for <laughs> the incredible daughter of mine that walked out and the way she walks the runway, I just, yeah... Obviously, took my breath away. Really? Yeah, oh, still so emotional. <laughs> Just a little bit. What was it like having your family watching on? Um, I was just so proud, I suppose, because I felt like I've changed so much during the series. Um, and just to show them that it means so much to me and to show them that I can achieve it, I suppose it means that the world is limitless. Yeah, absolutely. 
And so, Mum, how are you going, Sam? I'm so proud. Just overwhelmed. Yeah, Sabine really had an absolute tunnel vision about what she wanted to do, and she's just gone out and and done it. (laughs) Lakeisha, I know you're proud of your sister. So proud. (laughs) My little bean up (laughs) there. I just want to give her a massive hug. (laughs) There are no rules. You've beat thousands of hopefuls to be here and every week in this competition, you have got stronger and stronger. You've both proven your worth as models, but tonight, there can only be one winner. For your final photo shoot, you shot an eight-page editorial for Elle Australia. Megan, Alex and I will be judging your hero shot from that shoot. The girl with the highest score out of 30 will fulfill her dream of becoming Australia's next top model. So girls, the big question is, are you ready to see photos? Yes. (laughs) Sabine, we're going to start with you. I just love the contradiction. You know, with the styling and with you, you have such an edge. And with the styling, you've got this pretty ballerina dress and you've got the grungy boots. But beyond that, it's your face that I look at. And you're just like, no, I'm sure. I'm like, I don't care. <laughs> like, yeah, like you, you look amazing. Thank you. So proud. Thank you. I just love everything about this. And I'm going to give you a 9.5. in front of camera you've just been going from strength to strength and I mean I remember in, in Milan a lot of your feedback was that you've just got this sweetness to you but you just need to get that edge yeah and that is exactly what you've done and I'm so so proud this photo right here out of all the weeks all the models every single photo that you all have done that's my favourite <laughs> Faulted. You're amazing. I love what you've done. It's a 10 from me. Sabine, this is beautiful. I, I'll tell you why it's beautiful. There's, it, it's kind of a big, it's a big frothy dress, and a lot of girls can wear a dress like that, and they can make it look a certain way. But you've made it look cool. It's a modern day version of what glamour is. You've made it young. You've opened up that kind of fashion to a whole new audience, and I think that not a lot of girls can do that. So it's very editorial. You know, you've taken something and you've given it your own personality, which is what's great about you because you know you're clever and you're funny and you're beautiful. So I love the fact that you're this girl, but you can do this as well. So I'm giving you a nine. Point five. That gives you a total score of 29 out of 30. You ready, Lena? <laughs> Let's do it. next top model, you need to beat Sabine's score of 29.
think your mum likes it. Oh, <laughs> oh baby, that's beautiful. It's really beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Sabine, what do you think of this photo? I think Elena has the most amazing face, so every photo of her is stunning, but this one in particular. Yeah. <laughs> Elena, I just think you have you have so much poise here. You look so gorgeous in the face, but from head to toe to the tips of your fingers, I just think you're owning every bit of this photograph and with ease. And it's like you've come into your own. I just think it's perfection. I can't false it. Elena, it's a 10 for me. Elena, you have just transformed so much the last 10 weeks, but I've been waiting to see that photo of you where you just relax into it and it's effortless and it's coming like it's second nature to you. And you've not only done that here, but you are just so beautifully composed and elegant and graceful and comfortable in your own skin in this photo. And you're 16. For crying out loud. I mean, that <laughs> just looks like years and years of experience. That's just, that's 10 weeks. Look at you. I'm so proud of you. It's a 9.5 from me, honey. The only way you can become Australia's next top model is if you get a 10 from Alex. I remember when we first started the series, you know, you all came and said how much you wanted this and how much, you know, you dreamt about it since you were little girls or whatever. And I think I said to you guys, I don't care about the words. It just prove it. Like, make beautiful pictures. And this is a beautiful picture. There's something effortlessly beautiful about it. You're really aware of everything in your body. You've taken a dress and you've made it look completely expensive. This is probably the first shot, I think, in the whole competition that we've seen where it's absolutely you. Dropped your guard and it's the truest of all the pictures that we've seen of you. But I have to ask myself, is this photo the one that wins you the title of Australia's Next Top Model? And it absolutely is, so I'm scoring you a 10. Happy to say you are Australia's next top model for 20 years.